Hey guys, go get your make more videos again today guys. Finally we have no resistor LED turn signals and we have a 2014 Honda Accord as well as 2016 Honda Accord. But this works with pretty much any vehicle that uses this type of bulb. So without further ado, let's get to it. So as I said, we have both Honda Accords in here, the 2016 and also the 2014 right here. But this works with this 2019 model and pretty much any car that uses a 7440 bulb. And pretty much nowadays, a lot of vehicles use this type of bulb, guys. Even my 2013 Honda Accord uses this type of bulb. So it's a pretty popular bulb to be used as a turn signal. However, they never come in LEDs. They always are in amber, 2016 model, amber. Even the 2019 model has amber it doesn't have christmas brightness all this kind of stuff that you want from an led bulb and the one thing i hated about led turn signals is that you always needed resistors these are resistors right here if you know the pain you know what i'm talking about that's why you're excited for this video because these bad boys do not require any resistors so without further ado let's actually open these bad boys up and let's install it on both of these and these by the way real quick guys i love these so much and i love the reviews and stuff that i decided to get four of these bad boys because i'm going to be installing them also in a lexus and another vehicle in the near future but for now honda accord baby let's do this so in terms of packaging it is pretty simple i mean it's just the bulbs right there no resistors that you require whatsoever nice giant heat sinks on here to keep everything cool these things are bright these things will get warm but these heat sinks keep everything nice and crispy and cool and then here's the actual plug you guys already know i love plug and play things and these bad boys are plug and play this is all aluminum structure really nice let's actually show you how to install it on the honda accord very similar on every vehicle guys on the 2019 it's going to be similar as well so like in the beginning of the video you saw i've already done this side right here and you saw how insanely bright they were very nice and crisp. there's no like lag or anything like that the original bulbs not crisp they're dull they're dim let's get and start doing this one right here so first thing first both model cars that one the 2016 updated look and also this one and even with the 2019 all you need to do is take out some pins and you can see right here you just basically put your a screwdriver and you can see I'm just using a bit. I'm not even using a screwdriver. No fancy tools whatsoever and just pull it out like so. One, two right here as you can see just pop it out and then pull it out like that. And then a third one up here. Pop it out and you're done. So you have three of them. Make sure you don't lose it. And next step, pretty simple. Just ply this bad boy out and then it will reveal the actual turn signal bulb in there. So make sure you know where the turn signal bulb is. As you can see mine is on top right here on this one. And this one is the actual turn signal bulb right here. And what do you do? First step is basically unhook it from there like that pull it out and you're done it's that simple guys and to make it even easier to you to handle this better you can even pop this bad boy open by pushing this tab right here and then pulling it out like so there we have it and then do not use your fingers to touch the bolt because that will shorten the life of this bad boy use something else and then bam take it out and you have the bulb right here and you have this bad boy right here after you put the bulb in a safe place make sure that you just connect the new bulb as you can see it's plug and play so basically push it in and you're done and then what i like to do is just plug it in and before actually putting everything together into the socket test it out so let's actually just leave it like this to see if they even turn on and as you can see nice and bright turned on looking great now that we know it's working there's no hyper flashing whatsoever let's actually put it back inside and let's see how it looks now in terms of putting this bad boy in as you can see there's a rubber piece right here once it goes in it's a good tight fit and that's what you want so you know it's easy so it's as simple as just you know pushing it into the uh, original hole and then tightening it down guys as you can see and now it's not coming out i'm even trying to super hard to pull it out it's not coming off. That's what you want. Make sure it's in there really nice and tight and bam, you're done. So I like to test it out just one more time, obviously before I put the screws back in, but you can do whatever you want. Put the screws back in and you're done. And putting these screws on, simple guys, you just push it in, bam one two as you can see and last but not least three all the way up here like i said this also works on a 2019 i gotta keep saying that because i know some people skip through the video and they're like does this work on a 2019 model yes it does i'm actually going to be using one of the bulbs that i have the boxes to put on a 2019 model later so yeah that's how simple it is and now let's go to the next car so now that we're tackling this one right here i want to show you how it actually looks in the dark because i know a lot of people are going to be like well how did it look in the dark before and after this right here is the original bulb that comes with the vehicle 
you can see right there it's good enough but it's not that crispiness that you know bmw mercedes uh, any led light uses it's not crispy it's kind of dull and then you have the actual led look at this guy absolutely beautiful crispy in and out as you can see there's no comparison and then what i'm going to show you also how it looks on the wall you saw it in the beginning you can see that entire side is just from that bulb and this bad boy is from right here so like i said this is the newer model but it's the exact same thing use a screwdriver to take these bad boys out and the last one is up here there we go and basically just pull this cover down now in the 2016 model guys it's extremely similar and this is the actual bulb right here so i'm just gonna unhook it first there we go i've unhooked it and then i'm just gonna twist it and pull it out as you can see it's similar it's simple and the same exact thing applies guys just you know use something to pull the bulb out as you can see and you're good to go put it somewhere safe plug the new led in plug it into this guy to make sure it works and just leave it like so make sure it is working right there you should be perfectly fine and now i'm going to put this bad boy inside so plugging it in is the same thing you just basically push it in there uh, into the hole and then just give it a nice little push make sure the seal is good there we go give it a little twist and you're golden that's it nothing is going to be touching that heat sink right there there's no wires next to it whatsoever and you're good to go guys let's put the cover back on like so done that's it okay so now that everything is installed i want to show you how the turn signals work because i know a lot of people are going to be like well you had your emergency lights on but the turn signals are what are important clean tricks that's when the hyper flashing happens well let's test it out to see if it actually works let's put the key in so the vehicle is in the on position let's actually turn on the turn signal so as you can see the turn signal is turned on back there no hyper flashing whatsoever and then when you go on the back you can see no hyper flashing guys and man they look so clean and crisp look at that i'll, I'll be turning on the tail lights too as well don't worry don't not worry i got you guys as you can see it's turned off right there and turned on so you know it's a turn signal and let's do the other side just in case there we go as you can see it works perfectly fine on that car as well it works perfectly fine as well so now what i want to do actually is turn on these brake lights right here on both vehicles and turn on these turn signals and let's see how they look at night oh my goodness look at that guys freaking really really beautiful crisp nice and bright crispiness there's no lag to it whatsoever as well as this one right here you can see clearly looking beautiful just super bright really nice and no resistors plug and play that's what i like guys let me back up here let you see the glory real quick i completely forgot to put this in the video however they do have other sizes including the popular 1156 size that many vehicles use for the front turn signal the link in the description will have all the sizes now speaking from experience since this is a new hot bulb they do tend to sell out fairly quickly once i upload the video so please be patient and they should be in stock in a few days if still not in stock after a few days leave a comment down below and i'll try to get a time frame for you of when they will be back in stock all right guys in terms of these bulbs i gotta give it a solid 10 out of 10 these things are crisp bright beautiful no resistors and plug and play best of all guys so i'm absolutely loving this right here i'm gonna leave it on both these vehicles i'm gonna put it on a lexus and i know you will love them Alrighty guys, that's pretty much it for the video. Hope you guys enjoyed it. Links to purchase everything is gonna be in the description section of the video below. You guys already know it. Those bulbs are awesome and they will make your vehicle definitely look a lot more modern because of the fact they're LEDs. If you have any questions or concerns, leave it in the description section as well. You guys already know it. I'll answer any questions that you might have. But if you like this video, make sure you smash that like button. Other than that guys, keep your share saying thanks for watching it. Peace.